Today, more than ever, companies are finding it harder to compete, differentiate, and win. Find out how global trends and forces are driving leaders to face new realities in operating businesses. Hi, I'm Pinky Webb, and today I'll be talking to Mr. Dominic Thurban, partner in the Ernst & Young Climate Change and Sustainability Services team. Hi, Dom. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you for having me. All right. At a time when markets are being disrupted and redefined by all kinds of forces, you say that the push for an integrated approach to sustainability becomes an imperative for all businesses. But what exactly does it mean to have an integrated approach to sustainability? So when you look at the way companies have thought about sustainability, it's typically been uh, you have a strategy function, you then have a risk function, you then have a sustainability function. I think what we're finding is that that approach is simply not sufficient anymore. Um, and that bringing strategy, risk, governance, sustainability, and community around the table at the same time is the only way that company, companies are really able to build strategies that will stand up to the forces of disruption that they're facing. You said that in truth, companies don't change. People do. So how can companies be transformed from within? I think so often we find that companies don't go professionally where leaders don't first go personally. Our own legacy thinking is our biggest challenge because in order to radically shift the way we do business, we actually need to radically shift our own Things. beliefs and yeah. mindsets. You've cited studies of companies who have been successful in their sustainability journeys. Can you tell us what are the some of the common um, characteristics that these companies have? Um, so number one, I think, is it's very hard to be successful without a commitment at the leadership level. Secondly, I think the other characteristic uh, that underpins the most successful organizations um, is a willingness to think beyond compliance when it comes to sustainability. Sustainability is not about compliance. Sustainability is about competitive advantage. Lastly, what would be the most important key message you would like leaders of Philippine companies to take with them from your con or our conversation today? I think the most important message to take from it is if there's one thing that the market is showing us at the moment it's that time is short um, and that really leaders need to have a sense of urgency in the way they're approaching these conversations all right dom thank you so much for sharing with us how companies can stay ahead by of course embracing sustainability thanks so much pinky this is pinky webb for ayala pov where we never stop sharing progress with every filipino